Hey everyone, what's up? How's it going? I'm Mariah and today we're going to be painting this 11 by 14 inch canvas. So I want to try some new color combinations. I usually tend to go for like colors, like cool tones together, warm tones together. Um, sometimes I'll switch it up, but it's hard for me in the moment to remember color combinations that I like. So anyway, I thought purple and gold would look cool together, so I just kind of wanted to use those colors today. So I hope you enjoy. Today we're going to do a flip cup just for fun. I'm going to start with a white base. put a good amount of white in there um, for everything everything else to sit on top of and mix into. My last painting that I just made, I feel like I should have put some white in there. It's a little bit dark. We'll see how it dries. Usually it tends to dry darker, so, um, but maybe it'll be good for my Halloween collection. I'm not sure yet, we'll have to see. So on top of the white, I'm gonna put in my purple. And it's really gonna get kind of mixed in there with the white. Um, I'm gonna pretty much use the rest of it today. All right, then I'll mix up some more later. Throw some gold in here. I want a good amount of this metallic gold. And then I'm gonna also throw in some of this pearl space gray, just a little bit, not as much. Just a bit. And then I think I'm going to throw in a little bit more white. And then a little bit of dark purple. All right, so I'm going to take the canvas up and flip it over just because I don't want to slam this down. You can do it however you want, whatever is the easiest for you. Let's see how it turned out. Right off the bat, I don't love this stuff. Maybe I put too much white, not enough purple. So I'm gonna run a little bit more purple through it right now. And then right now it kind of stands out. So I'm just gonna take this tool and kind of blend it in a little bit. I'm just kind of trying it on the fly, so we'll see. Not as forced. <laughs> so I do think it looks better to drag something through it so it looks a little bit more natural instead of like a thick purple line, uh, whereas the rest of the painting doesn't look like that. It doesn't have to be perfect, but I do like this better with a little more purple in there. Torch it, pop the air bubbles. Oops. I'm really glad I ended up adding that extra purple. I think it really makes it, honestly. It makes it a lot more interesting. So I'm really happy that I did that. And this canvas, I put plenty of paint, so that's good. I'm trying to break that habit that I have of not putting enough paint, so. I've been doing better. And this is the finished piece. 
it's a little bit different than what I've done. I mean, a lot of my art has purple in it, but um, I don't know. Let me know what you think. I'm not sure yet. We'll have to see when it's dry what I think about it. Um, I might tinker with it just a little bit. Like this part here looks a little flat. So I like that better already actually. Any other spots? No, everything else looks, seems to flow pretty naturally to me, so that's nice. I'm gonna leave it then. <laughs> Let me know what you think of this one in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. I'll add a photo of this dry at the end of the video. Please like, share, comment, it helps me so much. So I really appreciate your support. Thank you, bye.